well, we thought about fostering before we had our own children and, and we didn't pursue it because we thought, well, you know, we haven't had children, I don't think we could foster. But looking back on it now, I wish we had because I think we would have made good foster carers then. I think we would have fostered different children, we maybe would have fostered older children um, and I think it would have been a bit of an adventure. But yeah. we didn't, we waited. I think lots of people say, oh, I couldn't foster because, but they don't realise there's lots of different kinds of fostering. Yes, that's right. I've, I've recruited lots of other people to foster, but in different different ways. Yep. So some people who just have one weekend a month that yep. they can give up, so they can just do short-term respite. Yep. Um, and then just short-term fostering, so that you just have children for a little while while they're lo we're looking for a forever family for them. That's what we do, because we've got young children of our own. It's nice for us to foster for a short period of time. And then we have a break and we kind of, you know, get together again as a family and then decide when we're ready to have our next placement. But you've got a long-term placement, well, haven't you? Well, he came for the weekend and that was seven years ago and we fell in love with him and he's going to stay with us forever. Yeah. And he tells me that he's going to look after me when I grow old.